Good morning, dear students. How are you all? I hope you all are fine, healthy, and safe at your home. So, as we know, lockdown throughout the country, throughout the world, going on. Keep yourself safe at home, and kindly do make use of your time properly. So, today I have brought for you a short session on the introduction of topographical maps. As this is a new concept in your syllabus. first time you are going to attempt topographical map so let's have the introduction first of all let's go for it so topographical maps what is topo sheet you may have doubt about this children basically this is a kind of map only maps are of different types classified on the basis of scale and basis of their function talking about basis of the scale maps are large scale and small scale large scale maps are topographical maps they provide us the large detail of the area like man made features natural features roads wells agriculture occupation of the people type of vegetation they are found small scale maps provide us small information like atlas map which you were doing in the junior classes so this topographical map is being prepared by the survey of india and the objectives of this kind of map is to conduct survey within the country provide the political physical aeronautical charts and demarcation of the external boundaries of the republic of india and this also help the teachers the students to have the proper knowledge about the area so in our syllabus what we have to study we have to study two sheets only uh, let me take you uh, to the map of india once again as you can see this is the map of india divided into different grids in this grid 45 is highlighted as this is the part of our syllabus this grid is further divided into 16 more grids you can see grid 45 is divided into 16 grids named a b c d up to p we have to consider only d part then further d part is divided into 16 more parts now here grid 7 and grid 10 is highlighted so this is the part of our syllabus grid 7 and grid 10 so our syllabus becomes 45 d 10 and 45 d 7 this includes the parts of gujarat and rajasthan so this is 45 d 10 sheet and this area is mostly rajasthan of india as you can see here it is the sirohi district of rajasthan most of the area includes that and uh, you can see on this green area these are the mountains aravalli mountains and this is in the red color is the abu settlement the most famous hill station of rajasthan or we can say the only hill station of rajasthan that is mount abu and to the other part of this sheet we have 45 d 7 this also includes gujarat and rajasthan but most of this sheet includes the gujarat part and we are going to learn a lot about this sheet in the upcoming videos this is only short introduction with the topographical maps and this is going to be very easy session for you 20 marks of this topic will be there in the examination each examination and this is quite a simple lesson for you once you need to practice and you will score very good in this subject various color on the topographical map or survey sheet signify different meanings you can see the yellow color represents cultivated land green color represent forest area white color it represents barren land or uncultivable land blue is for water brown is for contour lines mountains sand dunes and their heights black color dry river streams survey trees all names red color represents permanent huts roads metal and unmetal roads thank you stay safe Stay home God bless you all